95.7 The Hog, The Morning Hog. Hey, it's time for a Morning Hog Brew Review. Josh from SR Parat has brought our friend Jay from the Spring Turkey Run. We're going to be talking about hops and hood flavors from Veterans United, Terrapin, Big Storm, Sam Adams, and more. Stick around. Morning Hog Brew Review is next on 95.7 The Hog. 95.7 The Hog. Hey, it's the Morning Hog. Hey, how's it going? I'm, wearing, I'm Riggs. I'm wearing my beer shirt. Because it's uh, Morning Hog Happy Hour. That's why Josh from SR Parade is right there to bring the happy in the form of bottles and cans. I was trying to figure it out. Yeah, there you go. Like, by the way, did you see I'm wearing my racing hat? I see that. Do you know why? Because <laughs> it's time to go racing. Well, I actually drive responsibly around the speedway because cars are parked more than oh, right. racing this weekend. Because it's time for another Hops and Hoods Festival at the Spring Turkey Run, right? That's right. Hey? That's why I have Jay. Hey, Jay, welcome Absolutely. back. Absolutely. Hey, man, thanks. What's happening, man? Good to go. It's that time again. How yes, does it, it is. keep, you know, each year you schedule this event, I know when it is, and it still is like, oh, it snuck up on me again. We like to be sneaky like that. <laughs> right. We That's like right. to do turkey run all year long, baby. That's right. We're going to be ready for it. And fun begins what today? today? Right now, yeah. we're like we're you. I can't even believe you have time to come over here, but thank you for doing it. <laughs> Not a worries. And uh, and we're gonna get into some flavors. Some, some of some of, uh, some of them. Like there's many, right? Like this is point one percent. Dozens and dozens and don't dozens check the of math on that. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah please. Uh, we were told there'd be no math on the show. Yeah, yeah. Uh, except in twelve and sixteen ounce options. Uh, so what are we getting into today? Josh? So I have a few things. Uh, I think these all might be new. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. I like that. Yep. Okay. Um, we're going to start off with Sam Adams. Okay. And they're, uh, so we do, you know, normal Boston lager. Right. And then we typically do like their one seasonal, which would be Cold Snap, Summer Ale, Oktoberfest, Winter Lager, stuff like that. Right. Well, now we've started doing a second seasonal as well. Okay. So this is new for us. It's called Breakaway Blondale. I haven't had this yet. Breakaway Blondale. Yep. Nice. Mm. Got okay. a little American graffiti tie in. Yeah, there. right. The blonde driving right? away in the in the vet. Yeah, feel like this is all I appropriate like for the uh, for the turkey run. Absolutely. I mean, I can't even imagine why Sam would need uh, Sam. By the way, Sam Adams always putting together another beautiful, uh, yeah. fun flavor. Sta- probably stashing in a variety pack or something. Uh, absolutely. Yeah, it's it's wild to me. Like companies like Sam Adams, do they need to make more beer? Mm-mm. No, but they. They do it for us. They already got it right. Yeah. They're yep. trying to help you. Oh, that's real good. That is smooth right what there. What is happening with this beer? Mm. So 4.7% alcohol. Okay. Super easy drinking. Mm. Oh, quite literally, it says it on the bottle. Easy drinking. That's really that. nice. Yeah. Oh, it's good. It says it twice. <laughs> it's doing the it's work. It's almost for, like I know what I'm doing. It's doing the work for you. <laughs> <laughs> that's yeah, really good. A very nice, balanced, easy drinking, uh, like Blonde Ale. Right. When it's something we'll have over there at uh, Hops and Hoods tomorrow. Mm. Tomorrow. Yeah, oh my goodness. That's right. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. It snuck up on me. Like I gotta, yeah. I gotta cancel all my plans. Uh, yeah. So, by the way, thank you for continuing to do hops and heads, yeah. both of you, because <laughs> I think I felt like this is the perfect merger between SR awesome. Parat and the uh, and the spring turkey. Well, for both turkey runs, really. Absolutely. We we couldn't do it without them. I mean, yeah. Parat is amazing. They help us put this thing on, and it draws the crowd in. And I mean, it's just a it's an amazing event. It really is. So this is something that you can be doing while you you get your uh, you get your sampling passes right your yep. tickets right yeah uh, and a lot of times people will will short sell it they won't get enough and they're like wait a minute I need more beer well that's okay they always have more tickets right well so we kind of changed up oh. uh, what's going on over there a Let's little bit it. in the last uh, I think the last two events mm-hmm. um, so you can buy tickets like you normally do right or you can buy a wristband the wristband and yeah, you can go wish. unlimited I like Absolutely. that. Um, yeah, I, I mean... And why would you want limitations in life? Break free. <laughs> exactly. Get the wristband. <laughs> it's well worth it, though, because you can get samples for hours, right? I, mean, you I believe it. 12 to 4, if I'm not mistaken. That's, that's yeah, time. yeah. And it's, you know, it's it's four samples. Five bucks for four samples. Ten for ten, which sounds reasonable. Mm-hmm. Put the unlimited, 35. Get that. Yeah, yeah, you're set. You don't have to keep going back to the booth, standing right. in line. Right. Just enjoy the beer. Enjoy the cars. Yeah. Have a good time. That's right. Yeah, and I mean, even if you don't come to the beer festival, there's tons of beer stations throughout the whole place. Grab right. some Yingling, Miller Lite, Coors Light, stuff like that. Exactly. Um, but this is where you can come and try some of the new stuff that's out there and, uh, you know, give it a shot. The great thing about beer festivals, you don't like it, dump it out. I'm yeah. not, yeah, it doesn't offend any yeah. of us. Yeah, yeah go on know, to the next and one. And then move on to the next one. <laughs> Find what you like. Don't dump it on the table that you got it from. Just no. a quick no. tip. No. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> it's rude. Uh, it's still, I mean, it's still beer. It's still beer. Uh, although right. there's things other than beer there too, right? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. There'll yeah. be uh, ready to drink cocktails, right. um, ciders, mm-hmm. malt beverages, uh, seltzers. Okay, good. Mm-hmm. Everything. It's the whole the whole family. That's what yep. Hobson Hoods is all about. Yeah. Uh, all right. What's one of the other flavors we can try over there? 
You, you recognize that? Don't yeah, you? I do a recognize little bit. that. I can't believe you did it. I can't so, believe you got it in here. So Terrapins made a beer over at the uh, their baseball stadium, right? For the Braves stadium for gotcha. for a time now, right? Um, and we were not privileged enough to have it because it was exclusive for Atlanta and and the ballpark. Yeah. So they had a beer. It was called Los Bravos. Los Bravos. And they're mm-hmm. like, you know what? We should share it with the rest of the world. Yeah. So they brought it back, and unfortunately, because of licensing and stuff like that, um, the name was changed, and it's Terrapin Cerveza. Okay. Mm. Mexican style right, right with that. Yep. Five point one percent. This should be another easy drinking beer, especially you know, uh, if you ever get the chance to make it up to the Brave Stadium and check out their little uh, their system mm. up there and their their tap room yeah. they have there. Uh, some really cool experimental beers. That's where they like to kind of test crowds and and have right. people check things out and see if they're liking so it. And they move forward onto bigger, bigger production, moved over to Athens, and then yeah. we get it down here. I'm waiting for you mm. to invite me on one of those trips. To, uh, that is awesome. I, I've, I've been, I'm only avail- been once. I'm available. I need to get out there. Yeah, whenever your next one, if you got uh, to. I'm in. I'll, I'll, I'll carry luggage. I don't mind. Uh, but the, Terrapin does it right. Now, I bought uh, some, last time I was in Atlanta, Yep. I bought some of the Los Bravos, Yeah. right? And I've been hoarding it. Now I don't have to. <laughs> now you don't here, have to. Right? Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> these, <laughs> these actually come in 12 packs. Really? Straight nice. flavored 12 packs. Oh, that's fantastic. So keep your eyes peeled. Um, I know they're definitely on ABC, Total Wine, some local independents, or you always check out our website. He means srprod.com slash beer finder. That's what he's talking about. Uh, and now this, and again, this is a very uh, uh, re- uh, manageable ABV. Yeah, 5.1%. 5. 5. Another 1. easy drinking. Yeah. Um, we'll see what the weather brings. Yeah. You know, it's right. Florida. Right. Yeah. It should be nice and <laughs> nice and comfy. Though, if right you've thing. got cool cars and beer, the weather is always perfect. No Fair enough. What the weather I is. I like it. What, what are some of the uh, standout things for you this time around? Because obviously you put this event on, you're always trying to add something new, something fun. So what's going on with the spring turkey around the Gosh, we, we have some really cool things. Uh, Avery Schof, he's got a show on Netflix mm-hmm. as well as a history channel. Uh, he's from Canada. Uh, he does a lot of restoration. He's going to be hanging out with us. This guy is a trip. I can't right. wait for you guys to meet him. He <laughs> yeah. is just, he is so funny. He's just a great, great car guy. He's going to be hanging out with us all weekend. Uh, Larson Motorsports is bringing their jet car dragster. Really? Oh um, that'll be displayed right up there in the hub, right across from Avery Show. Oh, I love um, that. The reason they're in uh, House of Color, who's the sponsor of they're a paint company, Okay. they're sponsoring the Charity Brush Fest. This is the second one this year. Okay. Uh, all these pinstripers come and they pinstripe all these panels or anything you want pinstriped and then it's auctioned off and every single cent of that goes right back to Habitat for Humanity right here in Daytona Beach. Awesome. That's killer. So, um, as well as all the cool cars, all the cool food, uh, the beer fest, you name it, we're doing it. It's its just a great weekend. It starts today, the 22nd, That's goes right. through Sunday, the 24th. Mm-hmm. Come out and see us. Make sure and come tomorrow for the 23rd on Saturday yeah. for the for the beer fest. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's it's, it's, it's going to be great. Get your tickets online, turkeyround.com. You can buy your beer tickets right now. You get a special parking pass if you buy your 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 uh, beer fest tickets really? online. So, yeah, that's absolutely. A big, that's a big deal. Yeah. Don't overlook the parking pass. Yeah. yeah right? Seriously. Okay. I mean, because uh, yeah. depending upon how many of these you have, you, know, yeah. you want to you have somebody be able to find your car and drive you home. That's, that's right. That's a, yeah. that's a good tip. Uh, all right. We got more flavors to try. More coming up on the Morning Hog Brew Review right here on 95.7 The Hog. 95.7 The Hog. Hey, it's the Morning Hog. Morning Hog Happy Hour Friday. That means we've got Josh Mess, our Parat, right there. Jay from the Spring Turkey Run, Daytona yes, International sir. Speedway, starting in hours from now. Yeah. You really need to get to work, but we're going to let you <laughs> we're gonna let you try another couple beers with us, too, because exactly, I know you, yeah. you, probably, you probably need that before you head into this weekend. Because <laughs> um, I was going to say you spend the whole year prepping for this, but you don't. You spend a couple months prepping for this because you just finished the, roll straight the, off November, November. the November exactly. turkey run. Yeah. yeah, it's never ending cycle, but it's worth it. Now. Right. But there's always somebody who wants to add something new. I'm glad that the uh, consistency now is the Hobson Hoods Beer Festival. Yeah. So yeah. thanks to SR Parat and you guys for putting this on. Yeah. Um, uh, turkeyrun.com. Absolutely. You can get tickets, by the way. The 35 buck wristband where you can try unlimited samples for like three and a half, four hours. Yeah. I'm saying three and a half because you probably have to hydrate and take a walk. <laughs> you got to do some shopping. Yeah, exactly. You know, I mean, yeah, I do some shopping. Uh, what's going to help me shop is probably that beer right there. This one right here? Yeah. You think so? Yeah, I think so. It's got a good look to it. <laughs> yeah, so actually, it's, uh, it has a great look to it. Um, it's from Big Storm, okay. who's kind of in the middle of a rebrand right now. Right. Uh, typically, we're used to their 16-ounce cans, their four-pack 16-ounce. Yeah. They're switching over to the six-pack 12-ounce. Okay. Um, so, in theory... I don't, I don't know if you're getting more or not. I don't, yeah, don't don't look at this as a downsize because yeah, yeah. this is just a more manageable. This way you can try more different beers with a, with right. a, a lower 
total volume. So we, uh, we've we definitely had their Bromosa before, right? Their Tangerine IPA. Oh, the Bromosa, Bromosa. is a taste <laughs> sensation. <laughs> it is. Um, they've decided that's such a great beer. Let's kind of do some variants of it. So they're going to do a line of a Brotator series. Um, so this is Bromance. Mm. Bromance. Bromance. Oh, I think I'm having one with this beer already just exactly. on the aroma. <laughs> so it's a New, New England uh, style hazy IPA. So it should have some really, really nice, oh. big, juicy citrus notes oh, that's to it. Mon- the monster. nose is really nice on it. That's like a big bear hug from a 6'6", six, 300-pound six, biker right there. So speaking of 6, it's 6.5% alcohol. Really? Nice. There you go. Okay. So we'll say it's a six-foot biker. I'll take that. Um, <laughs> <yep>. <laughs> that's, that's really good. good. That yeah, is a solid. really good beer. Mm. And I get where it does have a little bit of uh, Bromosa uh, back. Esque. Yeah, Bromosa-esque. But it's not, I wouldn't, uh, you know, hazy more than fruity. Yes, maybe. absolutely. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, uh, hazy IPAs, you always want that that nice juiciness punch up front. Yeah. Um, it's not a power wrecker by any means. Like I said, 6.5%. The, uh, the hot bitterness is definitely there. Yeah, um, but you could have a few of these and still be able to taste your food and, yeah. and other beers and stuff like that. Yeah, and there's good food at the Turkey Run, by the way. I absolutely, I found, I found some of those ven- those trucks and those vendors. They got some great stuff out there. So is it Hero, Gyro, or Giro? Yeah, what do you I, say? I've been corrected 14 different ways, so I don't yeah, know which yeah, one's I, right. I anymore. think it's Euro. whatever mood you're Euro. in. That's what you call it. And yeah. we've got those and everything else you They're can imagine. Freaking awesome. We work really hard to make sure we've <laughs> yeah. got a really good variety of different foods in there <laughs> right. and drinks, obviously. Right. So, uh, yeah, come on out, uh, you know, today, tomorrow, and Sunday. Be hungry. Yeah. Be thirsty. We got all the need. We can take care of all your needs right there. After a couple beers, uh, I found it's all easier to just point to the picture of the thing you want. And the people <laughs> exactly. say, yeah, we got, we got you, Riggs. We got it. Yeah. yeah you want a pizza again or whatever. <laughs> um, Shocking. But uh, yeah, no kidding. And didn't wash it down with this. Uh, so uh, while we're shopping around, while we're looking for some food, we're going to obviously have some more beers. This beer, I know a little bit about. I'm super anxious to try this. From Veterans United, right? Right. Right out there in Jacksonville. Jackson Town. Veteran owned and operated. Ooh, ooh. So this is Wacky Badger. <laughs> nice. Wacky Badger. Flor- f- By the way, Florida not known for its badgers. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> you never hear about them. So uh, our, our friend from Jeremy over there from Veterans United probably could tell me what the, the badgers are all about. Sure. Um, I'm honestly not sure. That's all right. So Spe- we'll speculate. Yeah. We'll speculate a little bit. And I'll ask him about it later. Um, but so this is a new offering from them. It'll be a full-time year-round skew. It's, it's another hazy IPA. There you go. Hazy. You can see the haze coming wow, off that is of good. it right there. 6.9% alcohol. Oh! Yeah. So pushing into that, that big boy range. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, this beer mm. looks cool in the can. Mm. You know, you got to have it. It always helps to have an eye-catching can, yeah. right? Look at that. Thing. Yeah, you got to check out the YouTube channel um, or the social media stuff. You can check out the can there. Yep. Or you can show up to Tomorrow. That's right. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you can just show up tomorrow at the Speedway and uh, enjoy the Hobson Hoods Beer Festival and, and the Turkey Run at the same time. Mm. Uh, and you can enjoy them at the same time. Right. You can get a couple samples. You can, you get the wristband, you get the samples, you go sh- you go wander around, you go shopping. Yep. You know what? And if you're really interested in like really comparing beers, sure. you could always, especially with that Unlimited, mm-hmm. go grab one of the uh, hazy IPA and go grab another one side by side oh. and that'll really give you the variance and differences if you want to get really interested and try a regular IPA versus a hazy you know a lot of times people will uh, listen to the brew review mm-hmm. and they will want to try this along at home well this is a chance to do it live with us right we'll be there, Absolutely. We'll be there exactly know? yeah yeah if Jay lets me in again, I think you'll probably will. Of course. You're so, always welcome. So what else is happening uh, over the weekend? Obviously, you have, uh, you know, you know, today we set the table for the fun, even though it's already full tilt by Friday, really, for you. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, and with it being spring break, so we're, you know, we're, oh, we're yeah. looking to see a lot more kids on Friday than we normally have. Okay. Because sometimes they're in school. So, um, you know, we've got the, the massive swap meet. Uh, we've got, you know... Um, 3,000 or so show cars uh, that you can go and look at. And then we have uh, about 1,400 cars for sale. So if you're shopping for a daily driver or your dream classic car, we've got that. That's a big deal, too, because a lot of people do that, right? They come out there like, this oh, yeah. is my chance to try to find yep. uh, a car. part or the car that I've been looking yeah. for. Yeah, right. and you know, there, there's guys that in November and spring, they'll 
to search the internet all year long, not be able to find the part they need for their dream car, whatever they're restoring. They'll come out to the swap meet, yeah. and nine times out of ten, they find it or they find somebody who can get that get it right. for them. So That's it's huge. just a, a massive in-person internet of all these parts and love collectibles this. and everything you could possibly imagine. So I love it. Yeah, it is a wonderland, and if you haven't done it before, this uh, is a, yeah, this is a good time to do it because things get crazy in November. You already think, oh, Christmas, now I'm money, I'm out. This is the time to do it, right? This time to shop. Absolutely, yeah. I mean, and and bring the whole family, kids yeah. eleven under. That's three. a good time. Fifteen bucks gets you in the door. Yeah, and then the only upcharge you're going to incur the whole time right. is for the beer fest. Uh, but you know, another thirty five dollars to just put that cherry on the top of your day on Saturday. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Oh my gosh, just I mean, we have. Great food, great drink, all kinds of incredible cars to look at, all kinds of all kinds of fun. A huge kid zone for the uh, uh, fun zone for the kids. Yeah. So come on out and have a blast. Yeah, this is a chance to see the stadium or to see the speedway and uh, and just check it out in a different way than you could maybe on a race weekend or something. Right, too, exactly. Right? You, you can know. actually walk down, yeah. you know, through the infield and actually talk to each other yeah. without screaming over the <laughs> race cars. <laughs> right, <laughs> right, right. <laughs> <laughs> kind of really gives you a scale of the size of the racetrack too, versus you know just watching the cars go around. Yeah. Once yeah. you're down there and actually get into those other places, that's right. You know, it's awesome. Now you've got a plenty. SR Prod is is representing big. Oh yeah. There's a lot of different uh, uh, breweries and flavors and stuff. Oh yeah. We just tried four of them, but there's lots, lots of more. Yeah, there'll be tons available. Um, you know, a lot of breweries out there. Uh, so yeah, definitely come out, hang out for a bit, and say hi. Now, uh, if we want to find these beers that you just said, a lot of the new stuff right now. Oh, yeah. Uh, is it all this stuff available right now? We can yes, go to sir. SRProd.com slash beer finder? Yeah, that would be, be it. Yeah. yeah. Do that. To Wine, ABC, Local Independents, okay. Public from Dixies, all these places, uh, okay. but always easier. Yeah, so always better to go by there. And uh, turkeyrun.com to get your tickets. Might as well get them now. If you walk exactly, up, you got to wait yeah. in the line at the speed. Well, you don't want to do that. Just yeah, do it now. Be, buy, you can buy your entry tickets online. You can buy your, your Hops and Hoods Beer Festival tickets online. And if you buy them all, you buy your Hops and Hoods Beer Festival tickets online, you get that special parking pass, mm-hmm. special okay. parking right out right. front, a little bit of VIP treatment it is for VIP. our beer-loving <laughs> brothers and sisters. You know, and, and once again, it's 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 going to be awesome in it. You know, we think our show is awesome. Our show got immensely better when we partnered with SR Parade. They they distribute the all our beer at all our beer tents all over the place. But right. bringing this Hobson Hoods Beer Festival and the way they show up and show out, it's it's amazing, and we yeah. love it. It's just a great part of our. Let's show. Let's try to set an attendance record. What's your record for the spring one? Do you have a Do you have a ballpark of how many people you have in there uh, per day uh, for the beer festival? Yeah, or just total. Just total. Uh, let's go. Let let's let's get uh, eighty thousand people 80, over the weekend. I'll My take that. Goodness. Not bad. Yeah. All right. I'll take that. Doesn't even fill up the seats at the speedway. <laughs> yeah. Come on. You can do this. Yeah. Yeah. Drop what you're doing. Let, let's go. <laughs> let's go. And you can. And by the way, you, uh, obviously you can go uh, when you get your tickets online. You can you can get for the full weekend. You're coming out Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. You can do single day. Or you can buy the whole weekend package. Yeah. Come yeah. hang out with us. Have fun. Check out the website. To learn where everything is, we got a beautiful map on there that'll show you exactly where Hops and Hoods Beer Festival is going to be, as well as everything else in the in the entire infield for the show. So check that. it out. Cool. Well, I'm going to shut the show down now. We're just going to follow yeah, let's Jay. Just, let's yeah, just follow Jay. Yeah, yeah, we're going to go work at the Speedway now. Uh, until next <laughs> nice. week. Cheers. Cheers.